They say all great things come in small packages, <laughs> but how about this little package? Can you spin around? Here you go, this is a little Tinkerbell. Oh. She's one of the smallest puppies in the country. Only weighs 180 grams, she's just five centimetres tall. Really wiggly this morning. And she's certainly woken up. She's been asleep much of the morning, hasn't she? She's adorable, and we're going to be talking more about her in 20 minutes. But I don't think we'll be able to prize her out of Charlotte's hands. Also, does it seem real? Oh! Also, this morning. teeth, Ben. Come on, Bella. Where is she? Oh, Bella, you good girl! She managed to navigate all those wires and cables. Well done. <laughs> she looks fantastic. What an amazing dog. Is Matisse exhausted this morning? Or Matisse does... was chill, but while we were partying, of course, he was sleeping on my bed. Does he <laughs> want to do any tricks this morning? Matisse, are you going to play? Come on. Come on. There you go. Your chance to shine now. <laughs> <laughs> is, he, is, he, is, is he doing an impression of Skippy there? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> Britain's loneliest dog has finally found a home, all thanks to Good Morning Britain. Freya had spent almost her whole life in a rescue centre and had been overlooked by 18,000 potential new owners. The good news, though, is she's now been adopted by Ray Collins and his wife, Jackie, who saw her on the programme and have given her a home. So well done to them. Karen, lovely to see you. And, um seeing much less of Oscar. <laughs> Very much, yeah. And how do you get a morbidly obese dog to lose so much weight in six months? I think, to be quite honest, with the help of PDSA and the food that they give us and um, following his every move, um, has kept us on track, to be quite honest. Now, the problem was, wasn't it, that your mum was looking after Oscar yes. and sadly your dad died. Yes. And that put a lot of emotional strain it on your mum, so there was it quite did. a lot of comfort eating going on for the dog. Very much so. But it was even before that, because um, dad used to do all the cooking and dad used to do Sunday roast just for Oscar. So, just for Oscar? Just for Oscar. He's had his own, but li li literally would have his own roast, potatoes, Yes, yes he meat. would have everything. And if anyone is interested in having pets for therapy visits, they need only contact the charity. Yeah. And then us volunteer coordinators... Try and make it work. Um, try and make it work. Well, look, try and make it work. Millie has been absolutely delightful. Probably one of the best behaved guests we've ever had. Ever had. Just beautiful. You can stick around, Millie.